The philosophy of Jainism includes the theory that time is cyclical, like a wheel with no beginning or end. Let's go into some of the basics of what is involved in the Jain time cycle. According to Jainism, the time cycle, or Galchakra, is divided into two halves, Avsarpini, or descending, and Utsarpini, or ascending. So called because conditions are said to get gradually worse, then better, during these halves respectively. Each of these halves is divided into six unequal periods called aras, which can go from 21,000 years to uncountably many years. The longest ara is Sukham Sukham, or very happy, kal, during which Jainism says the earth provides health and wealth, there is no disease, and therefore no need for Tirthankars or religious guidance. Conditions are said to gradually worsen after this ara until the opposite and shortest ara, Dukham Dukham or Very Unhappy Gal, during which it is said things get so bad that the Jain religion goes extinct for some time. After this ara, things are said to improve gradually until Sukham Sukham Gal is reached again. In between these extreme conditions are the middle aras, during which there is some happiness and some unhappiness. These are the times when Tirthankars are born in our region of the universe. One Tirthankar is born during the third ara of each time cycle, and the remaining 23 are born in the fourth ara. Currently, we are said to be in the fifth ara of the Avsarpini, or descending half. Although Jainism says things will get worse from here, this does not mean we are told to despair and give up on peacefulness and environmentalism. Good deeds will always bind good karma while bad deeds will always increase our bad karma. Thank you for watching, hope you enjoyed, and for more information, check out the links in the description.